guys welcome back to the channel Anon here now it's time to play Nino Kuni again I've been playing this game still you know um, so the three main games I guess that I've been playing is this Nino Kuni um, Tower of Fantasy and Seven Nights 2 I'm not sure if I want to play in another Netmarble games really after everything that I see how this game is progressing, I'm not too sure. I'm currently just kind of spamming or in a group with some big whales <laughs> like Mormillo and Dior in, in our kingdom. Uh, just a, I guess this is just a quick update. Um, my kingdom is currently rank 3. Oh wow, rank 3 um, from the whole thing. Um, I think the one that's really difficult, of course, to beat is Atheria, you know, they're just big whales, guys, like, you know, look at it, 3 million, there's one guy, Rangsit, 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 um, yeah, so, another 3 million, where's Rangsit, is he here, maybe he has renamed himself, I don't know, he was selling his account actually because um yeah I think he's not gonna play anymore maybe he already sold it to somebody but yeah yeah crazy crazy guy um I mean I guess you can see the ranking right so you go to social or rankings here overall rankings all characters yeah I guess one of this ah uh, yeah this guy used to be very crazy but he hasn't been popping up you know uh, he's using a different character this one is his main look at that crazy plus 60 <laughs> how much money is that um he was using for farming I guess but yeah crazy crazy town um look at his um familiars Level 10, 300. Level 10, 300. Oh, come on. Level 10, 300. Man, this guy is crazy. Okay, this guy is still one of the his best one. But yeah, this one is the new whale. The new whale. The same thing. Look at it. Look at this tree. Oh, my goodness. Uh, which one is his main? Yeah, this one. But... Look at this one as well. Oh man. How much money are you throwing to this game? Crazy town. But you know the weapons are not as... Oh yeah, still good. Plus 55. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Anyway. Yeah, my account... <laughs> Rank 197 guys. 1.7. CP. 1.7. I don't know how, how I can get 1.7. Maybe in total... Uh, maximum ever you know it's 1.7 um but yeah I'm, I'm still playing this game enjoying this game um oh um we got a lot of freebies this month uh sorry this month yeah this month i guess um because it's the 100 days i guess three months or three months and a bit of the game being out so we got this event uh, 100 days launch which is pretty good you got free stuff free um, mount which is this um, what do you call it deer here um, you got like really good six star mount decoration and then this is the great one um, familiar selection cops capsule and the last one is also the weapon right so I'm definitely gonna choose this one, Chronos Blade, because I haven't got it yet. I've got everything else, well, except for the Fire Sword, Calamity Blade. But it's fine, because I'm not really looking for, like, like see, as you can see here, I've got them, but I'm not really using them. You know, because, well, this one I will use for PvP, the same as that Chronos Blade, so I'm gonna upgrade it soon. But so far, I'm just going to use 
you know the four the standard four stars because I can maximize them to you know awaken ten and that has so much higher value, right? Higher um what do you call it attack here? As you can see four nine twenty compared to this, right? Only two thousand. You see? So yeah, I would use that. We have been slowing down this game quite a lot in terms of like trying to keep up because you know I guess the you know the issue is they're starting to have that um, upgrading the ceiling all the time but not giving us enough ways to grind for those ceilings okay what 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 that means okay so they release pets for example pets would increase your CPs but you can get weekly uh, stuff for your pet or weekly summon just one um, weekly but then to fuse this to fuse this pet is really expensive so 1500 to right you know it's crazy right and you know the chance is so low as well and if I want to try to fuse this the chance is only like um, like 70% 60% or even 50% to get a four star to make it worth it okay so yeah, so not there yet. Um, what other ceilings that it's creating? Uh, the mount. Um, the mounts now have uh, decorations, which also increase. You know, all of these decorations also increasing your HP, your you know attack, you know, evasion, whatever. Right. So here is attack, for example. You know. So you need to upgrade this as well. You know. Um, so keep on going and after this there will be other stuff that you know you can you, you need to grind but there's so like small area to grind to get them to get them upgraded you know so those ones are fine um toys are fine now but they keep on upgrading the ceiling and and with that it will come with the usual you know have to go to the shop and keep on buying stuff right and, but the problem is also because everybody's moving at a similar kind of pace then the competition becomes really hard like for example if I go to the not the field boss what am I doing um, to the um, familiar arena right right you need to keep on upgrading your familiars and this place is the only way you can get the rewards for I'm in diamond 3 right so the reward for diamond 3 like it doesn't have any significant upgrades right this one is pretty good but you know it's not really necessary but the the ranking reward for weekly you know you need to get the minimum top 10% okay to get to get this that's the right the currency that you need to Kind of like get special staff progress or even just get a pet summon um ticket right it's really hard to get this because the top 10 percent is like i don't know i guess i can't really see where it is but like you know 2300 so top, top, top 10 percent would be around 2200 something 2250 or something like that really hard to go there okay you know and then the season ranking is the same right season ranking you need to get that top 10 percent and it's really hard because you know like they get really tanky nowadays and look at this two nine six you know, these two must be you know the way to do it is you check check the profile right check the character look and you look okay what's the highest one that he's got there um you know, okay, so he's got this. Here you. He's got Tarakona. Okay, he hasn't got really much, but I bet you, if I try it, let's try it, right? You know, for science. Let's try against him. Okay, positioning is all good. Maybe, maybe I will win. He's probably gonna he's, but bring Tarakona in. No, it's not. Okay, <laughs> probably gonna be dead. Um, you know, it just depends on the, the rank or the 
the levels of these units, right? Okay, I'll just go for... So his disbelief might be really high. So yeah, see? Maybe not. So his swear use... Oh, this, this pingy corn is really high, guys. This pingy corn is crazy. Right? I'm dead. I'm dead. And the hardest part about this is actually not... Not finding the correct team, okay? The hardest part is the defense has a lot more... Yeah, Siryu, MPP, 62k. That's weird. Because my Siryu is around 66k. Maybe it's the positioning that is working for him. But he's pingy corn, right? 62k, okay? So as you can see, he's not even using like um, any rares, right? Using just normal units and he's clapping because he's got 300. Um, uh, what do you call it? Plus 300 from the enhanced. Okay, I would probably can clap this one to fire. Okay, let's try that. Um, let's see. Right, it's hard because the problem is also because of Toko is really tanky. Right, if you just play t tank defense, most of the times you're going to win. Because the people cannot beat you in time. So if you lose time, right, like like this time, um, the timer, the fight timer, if Toko is not dead by the time ended, they will win. So that's why defense is always like just try and create like really good defense. And most of the times you will win. Okay. Uh, yeah, this is, this is not, this is the thing, right? He's got really high Toko. You just have a look at the Toko. He's got 10 plus 300 Toko. You need to bring mostly uh, red units, so otherwise it's just not going to work, right? Look at him, 300 this, you know, attack not all bad, but this will basically create a massive shield, alright? Uh, this one, yeah, this one, this one is high attack, right? So, that's the issue. The issue is sometimes you just need to wait, right? So, you want to play it, like you gotta wait, and wait until it's free to refresh in... 15 minutes and you try again. Go in and try again. Don't force brute force it. Okay. Um, now I want to pick something here. I want to talk some about about this free unit. Okay. Initially, I was going to get Molten Lion for PvP because what it can do, it basically can the active right when you click it, it becomes immortal and instantly restore HP. Okay. So I thought this would be good because in PvP it would kind of help right a lot. And then in the in the um, arena, uh, the familiar arena here, uh, it basically can kind of tank a little bit more. But as you can see, I was we were fighting the multi line. It was nothing, right? So the one that I was thinking of getting is these two. Uh, you know, whether it's the crab or lantern, right? Basically, it's almost similar. Becomes immune to damage, you know, and then getting heal and then familiar skill damage is increased. You know, and then um, the passive is basically reducing the crit and um, reducing the damage if you bring in a lot of light um, familiar, okay? Uh, and then here, it's just being silly, you know? So it looks as if it's not as good, right? But I think this is very good... Um, it's almost similar to, to to this, becomes immortal, but instead of that, immune to damage for a little bit, right? So that it gives you that small chance to escape. Uh, well, this one is tank, but the problem with this one is when you do this, you know, becomes immortal, you still can get trapped. Well, this one, you know, I don't know if you immune to damage would mean, you know, you can't you know, immune to stun or whatnot. Um, but that's the that's that's the thing that I wish I can test it, right? I wish I can see it a little bit more. Maybe maybe I you know I can find YouTube videos. And then or this one damage from player three percent down and stun resist higher, and then deals the damage and then seal their familiar, right? For five seconds so that they can't use.
But this, how often are you gonna seal the familiar, right? If I think about it, right? Because most of the time, they will already use their familiars when they're fighting you. And if they already used them, you can't really see their timer. So there's not really a point, right? You get what I mean? Um, so between Rimu and this one, Rimu has a better passive, but between this one, uh, these two, the utility is better of this one. Now, why I'm considering these two? Okay, if you think about it, these two, you cannot summon from the banner, guys. Okay, you can't get this from the banner. You can only get it from the shop, the metal shop. From this shop here. Asteroid shop. That's why I'm kind of like annoyed that we can't get more asteroid because the ceiling the ceiling for uh, PvP is getting higher. It's getting harder to get this asteroid. This is the crypto BS that we have, right? If we can buy it with just diamonds or something like that, then it's a different story where we can grind diamonds, right? But because this is not, it's behind that, it's really annoying. But if you think about it, right, you know, like this, for example, pet salmon, right? I want to get this, but I cannot because then you have to use this asteroid. And the only way you can do it is using the cryptocurrency way, right? That's This is how, you know, a lot of people saying that they are killing their game. I kind of tend to agree to that because it's everything is like, you know, you can buy it, you know. But it's fine, like, you know, if you want to skip everything and buy, go for it, right? But I would like to be able to kind of grind and achieve it in a way. But at the moment, I cannot because everybody who is buying will be able to get more of this. While, you know, if I'm just low spender or just moderate spender, I cannot get it. But the reason why I would like to get either of these two is the value. Okay, this 70,000 asteroid equates to around $210. US okay to to just buy it off the shop you cannot get you cannot get it from summoning so here for example if we go to the summon screen right oh I don't know why it's a bit slow this event for example right you look at the summon rates okay you can get molten lion here right you can get molten lion but you cannot get you can get bunny pot, but you cannot get those two. Okay, it's exclusive to paywall. Okay, and they're giving it for free. Okay, as a as a as a selector. So in my opinion, right, I would rather choose one of them, which I would do now. I would choose this one because the passive and the active skills are much better. Okay. Are much better than the other one okay and not only that okay if we go here well i've got the toys as well so which is great so i've got the toy for it where is it you i cut the toy so i can equip the toy right exclusive toy for the the unit which is great yeah, by combining it's just got lucky oh, oh combining or opening something so so yeah much better that's 200 dollars in your pocket for free okay so i would rather do that because everything else you can you can summon guys right everything else you can summon right like like what whatever in that box just now everything else you can summon okay so that's why i would suggest you select between crab or lantern or remo whichever you kind of want okay because at the end of the day everything else you can summon all right okay so i need to upgrade him yeah, I've got some beans here, okay. Select these beans here. I'm just gonna select all of the light beans. Finally can use some of this. Okay, and then later on you'll also get the rare weapon selector. Again, select those that it's gonna be hard for you to get from from the from the banner if you can't get it from the banner and it's given to you for free select that guys because it's gated behind a paywall okay huh. cool cool box okay where is he all right select all light beans 
Okay. Now I need to evolve him. Okay. Level up again. And this is going to be expensive. Look. 117. And evolve again. Uh, I need 30 of that. 30. So I need 13. Luckily, I've got plenty. Alright. I can select 13. There you go. Okay, let's evolve. Oh, wait a minute. What do you mean? 10 more. 23, guys. Sorry. It's early morning over here. All right, now. Now, here we go. Okay. Here we go. Let's go. Let's. Um, let's upgrade. Let's upgrade this upgrade. Let's go enhance. Oh no, sorry, evolve. There you go. Now he's ready to bring to PvP. Uh, look at this one. This is going to be super expensive. Yeah. <laughs> Only level 11. Not really ready yet, but I can claim. More summon tickets. And... CP, upgraded CP. So if you're using Engineer, that Crab Bot is really... Sorry, that Crab Unfamiliar is really good if you combine it with um, the Bunny Bot. Okay, because it will give you like really um, high survivability. And not only that, it will give you a really good, like, then you can heal, right? You can really survive a long time, both of them combined, right? So, you know, have that in your arsenal. Uh, so, yeah, just a quick tip for you guys, showing where I'm at with the the game. Uh, I've got lucky, uh, pretty lucky. I put, the, as usual, the pass for the boar. So I'm waiting for, um, what do you call it? Awakening, um, the Sorbor 210. But I need to wait for next week to get another one because, you know, every week you get to buy the ticket, uh, for, f for free from the metal shop. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, I'm just waiting for that to put it up to 10, but is it good in a pvp out in the arena sometimes if you are fighting against you know green team then yeah you'll bring them but otherwise it's pretty much gonna get clapped <laughs> pretty quickly <laughs> so even though already you know plus 300 I, I haven't seen one that's really strong well let's end it with some summons right as usual i've done 100 here from some free tickets and you know 1000 diamond but from now if there is an event, I'm not going to summon there other than if it is like really um, strong unit, the, the one of the meta units, uh, there are two of them, the meta familiars that I'm waiting for. But otherwise, I'm just going to spend it here to get the uh, rare um, guaranteed. You know, any free tickets, I'm going to start um, using it here because that's the only way you can get a rarer hat in the future other than just buying it out <laughs> straight straight from the shop okay am i gonna get one no but hatching hatching also you can get you can also get it from hatching so or even rare pets you can get it from hatching guys so if you're lucky you're lucky you know yeah no. Okay, Rambuctus. Okay, so you can also get get your familiars from here. Okay, so let's let's release the three stars. I'm not using them because I want to get the all this, which is good. Um, 
but yeah I mean like if you're hatching them you can get it from here you'll see the history my history here I think I've got the I don't know if it goes far enough but I've got, oh, recently I've got the four star yeah yeah another four star splisha okay wait a minute this is not this is not correct I don't know but yeah if you sometimes you can get that lately yeah see four star here again so yeah um I'm only up to the top 100 so yeah it's it's pretty good you know uh, they can heal some of those do you bug hatch or not it doesn't matter both of them has the same it's just one is just faster than the other uh, actually awaken special ah no I did awaken that already yeah this one already awaken as well um oh yeah this one this one I haven't awakened got it from just summoning and I think there's a uh, the bird yeah yeah straight away do you want to buy more buy buy come on man like give us ways to grind for it and then you can sell the the shortcut to the time to to, to the grind you know extra bonus drops and this like that you know buying those or buying weekly and this like that that's how you keep your players alive not not just buy it like you know here you can actually i'll show you this is um australian dollar you can actually just buy you can just buy the the this you can just buy the pet there yeah. okay this is around what 99 89 dollars us you can just buy it straight away yeah you can get the the equipments as well you know why why, why am i doing a gacha you know why do I gotcha? If I gotcha, if I try to summon it from the from the banner, I won't be able to get it most of the time. So why do I do that? You know, I might as well just get it. Like relay shop here, you can get it as well. Uh, I think in total, how much is this? Uh, that's three dollars plus eight. Yeah, that's eighteen plus thirty-nine, fifty, uh, fifty-seven, right? Fifty-seven plus. What is this? Plus 63, you know, 140 or 130 dollars. Those so are kind of similar, right? But this is only, you only get one of this. But it's six stars, right? It's a different story here. So most whales will buy this one and will buy, will buy this one, right? And that's it you know like and clap everybody and then have another one here so he's there's another one here that you can buy a molten lion and all this rare you know it's like come on man like <laughs> too much money net marble net marble game guys is all about the money it's not about the players that's 100 percent show so if you're still enjoying this game i'm still enjoying it so far you know it's nice mmo the music is great, the story is great. So yeah, just keep playing and spend wisely. Alright guys, that's all from me from the update of what I'm doing. Oh, wait a minute, I'm kind of like... Oh, yeah, Marmelo. <laughs> he's, he's always setting his thing like going around the shop. <laughs> anyway, I'm going around the, the whole field. Then know, it's like... Come on, stay, stay, stay there. Don't come over here. Whatever, it's fine. Um, that's all. Um, and yeah, uh, I'll see you in the next uh, video. Bye now.